Oh, Demon Hunter is tough to beat. This deck has a hard time against Demon Hunter. A one drop would really help. So yeah, my best draw, like Dwarven Sharpshooter. Uh, my opponent's thinking, is that allowed? Is that legal? Uh, I mean, the fact that I'm going first is a helps a lot. It's a huge deal. It means over the course of the game, I end up with a lot more mana. I could hold... Oh, wait. What am I doing? There's no way I hold this. I have a dragon for the scale rider. Well, the duck just likes to stay on my head. Even if I shake a little bit, it just kind of stays up there. But I can move it around. It's not like it's glue or anything. I could switch it out to the other duck. Oof. Temple good. Hey, I got you first. Josu! Thanks for seven months of Prime, much appreciated. Unleash all face. Next turn's like Ingenuity. I think I want to Shadow Weaver his turn five to stop Glaive Bound. I think that means I unleash here, and next turn I do Ingenuity Shadow Weaver. These are going face. I could trade my 3-3 three, three into, into his 1-2 to protect my 1-1s one a bit. Particularly good if he has an I-beam turn. I'm not sure about this trade. One thing I like about protecting the one ones is if in, if they somehow survive to Varanus, then that's a huge advantage. I, I would bet against it, but it's like I missed the three, but it entices him to miss two back. I think it's kind of worth. The trade has a lot to do with the fact that uh, he's gonna have a faster clock than me. I'm sort of the he's sort of the beat down. Oh, and K, thanks for 23 months. Quack to you too. Why the total time for each player? I mean, some people just like to know that kind of thing. Gives you a sense of how quickly you and your opponent are playing. It's not really crucial for anything. Just some people like to know. I'm curious. People like to know things, that's all. It's as simple as that. Oh, look at that trade. Wow. What does Zeph do with three mana? Shadow Madness? I could Shadow Weaver his face and backstab. Oh, I like that. I like that quite a lot. This is just so strong against turn five. Backstab, kill a 3-2, protecting a 4-3. God, it loves Shrine Temple Enforcer, as if it's a real card. He's looking at his hand of War Glaives, Glaive Bound Adept, Twin Slice, getting very upset at Frozen Shadow Weaver. Oh, the 1-1 one -one survives for the Varanus turn. It's insane. We did it. Kind of. This looks like a 3 plus 3 is 6 scenario. Uh, what dragon would I want in the future? Removal dragon? Next turn, I would Varanus in 1 mana, Ingenuity in 5 mana. I think it's removal dragon. Kill the uh, Glaivebound Adept. I'm actually ahead here. That Zephyrus was so good. The Frozen Shadow Weaver Zephyrus turn was so good that I'm just actually the beatdown. I have such a life lead, such a board lead, that he's actually in serious danger of just dying. This was kind of awesome. There's that Glaivebound Adept we just set up for. He has to trade the 1-1 one because one of Uranus. So Weapon Face sets up lethal with Weapon Hero Power. So yeah, just defense, right? Easy clap. Can't even I-beam this. He'd have to I-beam his own minions. Wow. Beautiful. Ooh. Are we playing poker? I've got a straight. This is a winning hand. What are we listening to? Um, uh, it's music. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. This is a great poker hand. Valley trades uh, particularly good against like praise on the Pharaoh Cat and then trading the three, two. 
This three two is obnoxious for the class that likes to play backstab and shadow step. <gasps> four four, that's illegal. I was gonna play a two four. Oh, top decked out of it. Genius. Take the cheap one. They're all like really garbage, right? So I take the cheap one. Maybe, maybe, no. Trading? No. Not in this lifetime. Can't make me. Yeah, that was an advantage of Zixor. It was better against Seal of Fate, but I think it's fine, right? I'm pretty happy with what's going on here. There's one beast in left in my deck, right? The six mana five five, and it goes well with the Tundra Rhino. Anyways, this turn's definitely four mana, and definitely trade. And then next turn could be like Zixor Ingenuity. And the Ingenuity would be setting up for the Scarlet Web Weaver plus Tundra Rhino turn six. Okay. Dude, this might be the actual... Oh my god. Oh my god. I think this is it, boys. This is the game. I'm so excited right now, you don't even know. This is too perfect. It's too perfect. Never just slam my rhino here. Absolutely not. That is obscene. What part of OTK Hunter do you not understand? Do you not see? Do you not see the OTK right now? He doesn't see it, does he? Oh yeah. I have played so many games with this deck. I just want to OTK one guy. Please, Blizzard. Please. All right, don't draw the prime this turn. Do not. Do not. I mean, if I draw it, it'll still be okay, but it's a lot cooler if I don't. <sighs> I'm so excited. This is actually unreasonable. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's the setup. There's the setup. We've got 26 charge damage coming in next turn. We have lethal setup no matter what we do. Therefore, I should find the most defensive line. Actually, I'm at 30. I don't need to be that defensive. We can really just push the whole murder concept. What does Zephyrus want to do with three mana here? I could trade and cleave. I'd like to go face Frozen Shadow Weave or something and Zephyrus for next game. It really doesn't matter. There's no way this matters. Yeah, yeah, Zephyrus is for next game. Look at this. 26 charge damage. 26 on turn 8. I guess I could have played defense, try and make it to turn 10, do a full 30 with Zephyrs. Or like... Uh, that'd be hard to set up. Nah, nah we, we just take these. We just take these. No regrets. OTK Hunter, baby. Oh, this works every time, by the way. I'm pretty sure if I played a thousand games of OTK Hunter, I would just OTK people on turn eight, like at least 900 of them. You run scrap shot? Yeah, me too, me too. If I draw it, I'll I'll do it. I promise you. If I draw the scrap shot, I'll do it. <laughs> Boom! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh. There it is. Let's just take a moment to just soak this in. Just really enjoy it. If my mouse breaks and I miss this lethal, it's a price worth the pay, you know? Life's about the little things. You gotta enjoy the little things. And this, I really want to savor this moment, actually did the thing. Oh, and it's just so beautiful too. here. Wait, no, no. That would throw it away. These would lose charge. Okay, trade this here. Trade this here. <laughs> oh.
Oh, it's just so beautiful. Oh, it, you couldn't possibly have a better note to end on.